Good morning. To an outsider, this shady hillside might not seem like the best place to grow peas, but the farms of Nova's east side have been producing for hundreds of years. You see, East Shadian peas don't handle direct sunlight like the continental variety. Now oh, look at me, talking your ear off about peas already. Say, if you're looking for things to see in this country, you should find your way out to the Teethmore Bluffs. There's some gorgeous farm country out there. When I was younger, I'd head out there all the time. These days, I find myself a bit too busy with my peas. Navian demand is higher than ever you know. By the way, if you need a few extra glowstones in your travels, I could use an extra pair of hands shucking some peas for market. I won't lie to you though, it's tedious work, can really drain you. I'd like to help. Fantastic, I'll show you what needs to be done. It's not too complicated. Okay. Oh, I helped. Well, that was nice. Howdy. Hi. Let's work again. Need a few more glowstones, eh? Well, that's great news for me. I lose a bit of inspiration every time, but I'm gaining 10 glowstones. That's quite nice. Does the time pass? Not really. Howdy. Hi. Let's see if there's anything to talk about. What about Nava? Well, I've never really given it much thought, to be honest. It's just the place I've always lived. Suppose I'll take it for granted a bit. It's a dreamy place to live, isn't it? It is beautiful. Well, let's work one more time. Say, I really appreciate the work you've been doing around here. Wonderful. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. I got 30 glowstones for doing some work shucking peas. Not bad. Can we go in this building? I really want to know. No. I can't get in it. Oh well. Alright, well I'll head back up these stairs. Oh look, there's some fabric. Very nice. It looks like we can roam around quite a bit here. Up to the wall. Okay. I don't see anyone else working, so... I guess we'll head back out. Go up this way, maybe. There's a chicken sitting right there. How cute is that? Well, I'm glad I found my way over here. I made some glowstone. Let's see how much I have. 83. I could buy a bike. Ooh, or a coat. I might try to buy a bike. That could help get around quicker. Hi there. Oh, I can't stop thinking about my dinner. Pea soup and mushed pickled peas. Mmm. We've got a lot of work down on the pea terraces. It can be draining, but I like to read in my free time. A nice book of poetry always boosts my spirits. I wonder if there's anything else to talk about. I don't know if I've asked him about roots. I probably have. Yes, I remember asking him. Well, you enjoy your peas. I'll see you later. Okay, so... I still need to figure out who I need to talk to about the chaise. Can I go in here and look? No. Okay. These people, they don't have anything to say, no. All right. I want to read these again. Can I? Doesn't look like I can, okay. I 
I don't know where to go to speak to anyone else. It's a nice song. I went in the tea house and no one there was talking about anything. I'm not sure where else I what else I need to do right now other than maybe I need to move on. I'm really not sure. I thought I'd pass by people again just in case someone now had something new to say. It doesn't look that way. I could head back down that way again too. I think I'll do that. Let's check the marketplace and see. Hello again. Hi. Thanks for rounding up those poisonous veggies. <laughs> what a shock. I was able to explain it to the market council. Well good. They said I've got one more chance. Could you believe that? I've got my eyes on the prize this time. No more mix-ups. Okay, you be careful. So I guess you can't really purchase anything from these people, You're can such you? Such a great friend, a champion of true love. Oh, thank you. Nope. All right. Let's just head down this way again. I can also take a couple of commissions as well. I don't have any right now. Have I been over here? I haven't. I see some fabric. Great. Oh. Oh, that was the poor guy that was sick. But I wonder if he would count as someone being sad. Let's go back and get this commission and find out. Oh, excuse me. If it's still available. Portrait of Despair. Let's try that. I may go ahead and just accept all of these. A small stone bridge. I know where a small stone bridge is. That would be easy. A lonely tower. There's a pretty tower all by itself over where I saw someone trying to uh, catch some fish. I could try that one. Great. Okay. This was the girl it doesn't really like her job. Can I buy anything from you? Hey, so you know that hot spring I told you about? Evelina and I went out there for a picnic. It was nice. And she asked me to be her girlfriend. So now we're together. Congratulations. That's great. It's so weird, but I feel like you had something to do with it. Anyway, thanks for whatever you did. Let me know if you need any weird tasting ground up plants. Yes, I might. Let's see. What could you tell me about the Shez? I think they're kind of like the Roots. They love dream teas too, but they believe only their gods should be able to drink them. What about the Roots? They're a group of people who like drinking this special tea because it makes you have better dreams. They hang out in the cistern under the city, but sometimes they have meetings on the Salt Spring Coast Beach. My brother loves drinking the tea, but it's so boring. I mean, it just makes you dream. You're asleep the whole time. <laughs> okay. Let me know if you need any weird tasting ground up plants. Well, it looks like I can't purchase anything, so that's kind of a bummer. There's the man that sells that elixir I don't really want. Oh yes, I wanted to look at her books Interested again. In a book? I think I bought the Shaddy and Tees one. Let's buy this helpful fishing guide. And let's see if I can read these books that I have. I haven't tried that yet. Okay, Fish of the Fellstream Re River. I read that before. Whoops. Um, tea season. Tea season blooms on the island. 
Did I read this? I don't know. I just got inspiration for it. Well, let's read. Air thick with the scent of budding herbs and brewing teas can only mean one thing. The season for wild crafting has finally arrived. Herbal flowers and tea leaves are coming into bloom and East Shadians, young and old, are eager to fill their baskets with the fine cuttings. Thanks to this shared fields law of all these delicious plants are free for the plucking. While locals are well aware of and very secretive about the best collection areas, tourists are encouraged to explore the land and collect what they find. Be forewarned, the herb black thistle remains an endangered species and should not be collected under any circumstances. Happy harvesting. Yes. Okay. One more book. Classic Shady and Teas. Oh, wick, I can learn how to make them. This was a good thing to get then. Mountain Wort Tea. Sometimes called walker's tea, the mountain wort elevates the heart and spirit, and hikers swear it makes them makes the miles fly by, so that makes you go quicker. Lindoian brew, I have had some of that before. Imbued with quaint, dreamy glimmer of its seaside port town origin, two white bloom sacks and one snatch of roots. I can make that. And then Earthroot Tea is a rich woody scent, two snatches of roots, and one inky cap. Wonderful. I have inky cap too. Okay. Well, I'm back out here at the end of the town and I don't see anyone to talk to about the Shaz anymore. I'll speak with what her one more time. Scales. Scrumptious raw fish. <laughs> I can't wait until dinner time. Let me browse your goods. I can buy a fishing pole. I was wondering because I want to go fishing. Let's do that. I'm not going to buy any fish because I will probably sell her some. Thank you for my fishing pole. How wonderful. Oh, and a kitty. Of course there would be a kitty where the fish are. Okay. I bought the kettle. I don't have enough money to buy clothes right now. I don't also have enough money to buy a bicycle because I spent all the money I just made. But let's try to paint this poor guy right here. I know he's sick, but he does look sad. So let's see if this works for sadness. There's a cat also sitting on the roof of that place over there. I just realized that's pretty funny. Okay, fella. I'm sorry you don't feel so good. We're going to see if this counts as a sad person. Let's try about like that. It does. A portrait of despair. Okay. Well, we've got one commission done. Let's take this back and get our money for it. Welcome back. We've got plenty more patrons interested in your work. Well, here's a commission. Did I have a picture of a stone bridge? I'm gonna have to look. They're so very sad. Let me look at my pictures. A stone bridge. Did I get a picture of a stone bridge and I didn't realize it? I did, right there in that one with the big tree. Okay, I think I'm going to sell that picture. That's the stone bridge I was thinking about. Okay, let's sell it. I don't think the picture I have is the correct tree. Welcome back. We've got plenty more patrons interested in your work. I have another commission. Not bad. Wonderful. So, how much money do I have again? 78. I'm very close to being able to buy that... Um... Bicycle? So, I'm gonna go talk to that bear man that sells you or will let you sell things to him for one glowstone? Maybe I'll sell him a couple of things just to have enough money. I'll be down to zero, but at least I'll have a bicycle to get around a little bit quicker on. I've never seen anyone on a bicycle, though. I'll be the only one, I think. Oh! That was weird. Last time we talked, there was an eclipse Howdy. going on. Hi. 
I would like to sell you something. Okay. Let's sell him these feathers. That other person bought them for one each. He should too. There we go. We have some eggs. Let's just sell a couple of those. This mystery blend, I don't know. I'll sell him that post tea season. I read that. Those books I have, I could probably sell those. I'll keep the tea, but maybe I could sell the, the fish. I don't know. Maybe I'll keep it for a while. I'll keep it. Oh, the toxic tuber. I wonder if I should keep that for something. I wanted to sell it, but I guess I'll keep it. Thank you. Let's go get a bike. This will be kind of cool. Okay, this person here was selling tea. So it was this person selling the bike. Hi again. Hi. Ready to buy a bicycle yet? You'll get around a lot faster. I am ready. Easy glowstones. Okay. Let's buy it. It's all yours. Hop on. Oh goodness. How do I hop on my bike now? Let's find out. Whoops! Hit the wrong thing. There's the bicycle. Oh gosh, there it is. Look at that. Mount. Oh, this is interesting. Oh, wow. Okay. Whee! Okay, I'm kind of scared. Let's just mount for now. I want to talk to this tea guy here. Hi! What can I brew you up? Let me just take a look. Mountain more tea and the meadow spice mead. Meadow spice mead keeps you warm. We know that. I would like to learn how to make that, but it's not a tea. It's a mead. That's the only thing. I'm not going to buy anything right now, but at least I know now what he sells. Okay, let's get the bike. Can I go up steps? I doubt it. I want to see. Oh my goodness. Yeah, this is quicker, but it's not very easy. Oh, you can go upstairs. Cool. Well, I don't know what else to do about the shaz and the roots right now. Let me look at my journal again. Whoop, I clicked the wrong thing. Journal. A group called the Shez are looking for any information on another group called the Roots. Yes, but where do I go to talk to these people? That is the question. Oh, I guess I'll go back and look at those posters. Where were they? In here? Did I get off my bike? I did. Well, that's tricky. You could accidentally leave your bike behind, I guess, huh? No, it wasn't there. It must have been down here. This is definitely faster than walking, isn't it? Okay, I'm confused. Where in the world were the posters? Whoa, excuse me, sir. It wasn't down there. It had to be up here. Oh, pardon me. Maybe right here? Yes, these were them. I want to look again. Oh, okay. Report suspicious roots activity to the Shez Temple located on the Tiffmore Bluffs. Okay. Well, that answered that. I guess it's time to leave the city. I'm pretty sure I have spoken to and done everything I can at this point. So I want to go... I want to see what that hot air balloon thing's all about over there. This is so cool. 
Riding on my bike. I'm gonna go this way, I guess. I don't know. Oh wait, here's a path. Good thing I looked that way. Whoa. Oh, cool. Where do I go from here? I wonder if I go around, maybe. Like this? Good thing the spike goes everywhere. Okay, let's dismount. And... Pack it. Did I pack it? Did I hit the wrong thing? Yes. Nessa's balloon. Hi! Hello, brave traveler. I can see you have an adventurous spirit. I've got an excursion you're sure to love. A flying excursion. Right, oh, sharp as a knife you are. This here is the bursting bubble. It has the ability to take passengers all the way up to the mountain top. Oh, wow. Why is it called the bursting bubble? The ride is sure to give you a burst of adrenaline. Okay, just so the balloon doesn't pop. That is a terrible name, but it sounds exciting. You think so? I wish more people had your spirit. Last person here said they'd never ride it with a name that sounded so dangerous. <laughs> It does sound a little dangerous. Oh, what if I call it the Sky Drop? Try another name. Neverland. I like that one. Yeah, that's a perfect name. Much better. Thanks, friend. You know, when I invented this thing, I really thought it was going to revolutionize transportation. Imagine just flying right up to the tip top of the world. Seems like something everyone would want to do. But for some reason, folks just don't seem to understand the idea. They can't seem to picture a balloon carrying people in the sky. I've hardly been able to get anyone out here to see it in person. Anyhow, thanks for helping with the name, Traveler. Seems to me that you're full of good ideas. Welcome. Hello, good Traveler. Hope things are going well for you. As for me, I still haven't got anyone new out here to fly with me. Shame, because I know anyone would love it if they saw it. I guess I have to go tell some people to come and see her balloon. So I think I've got to go back over to Nava, don't I? Is there anything else to see over here? I can't really tell. Okay, well let's get back on the bike. Let's go back to Nava and tell a few people, I guess. Whoa! Okay. Let's see if I can do well going back across. It's a little scary. <laughs> Okay, let's get off the bike and pack it up. Whoops, I did the wrong thing. Wait, no I didn't. Why can't to pack it up? Oh, so I had to select it first. Okay, hi everybody. Can I tell any of you about the hot air balloon? Hello. Don't you just love the music of the bards? Oh, I always wanted to be a bard when I was a child, but I never learned to play an instrument. I didn't either. Oh, I can't ask about... tell her about the balloon, but I can't ask about the roots. Oh, have you been there yet? I highly recommend it. Just relax, sip some tea, and have a lovely nap. A perfect way to spend an afternoon. What about the chaise? I don't know much about the group, other than that it's some sort of spiritual gathering. But they do love dream tea. It's sacred to them. 
I think my father-in-law belongs to their group. I should ask him about it. Hmm. I'd like to know who your father-in-law is. Does anyone care about the hot air balloon out there? Let's see what it says to do. Hot air balloon. It looks like I just need to find some people to tell, so I don't know. Let's go in here. Hi. Welcome to the inn below the tarnished teapot. Nope, can't tell him. There was nobody up here I could talk to, but I'll go back again, just in case. I like these posters, they're so neat. Hi! Anyone interested in a balloon ride? Anyone? Doesn't look like it. Balloon ride anyone? Hi! Would you like a balloon ride? Oh! What happened? That was weird. The people just morphed between- or right in front of my eyes. Hi! Ooh, I'll take that. Did the time change or something? I don't know. It's now everybody's different. That was really weird. Why is everybody looking this way? Something about to happen. Tonight at the Tarnished Teapot, 7 o'clock. Delightful melodies performed by Nava's own band. Is everyone getting ready? It's almost four. Well, it could be. I still can't talk to anybody, though. I would kind of like to see this. Very interesting. Oh, hello. It's four o'clock. I should get my bike back out. So pretty, cute little baby. It doesn't seem to be that I can tell anybody about this balloon ride. Would any of you be interested? No. Hmm. I'm really not sure. Let's check out some more commissions while I'm here. Oh wow. A natural arch and a starry cavern. Oh, wow. Okay, let's accept both of those. Hmm. I don't really think that there's anyone I can tell. Not right now, anyway. What time is it now? It's almost five. Well, let's get the bike back out. I 
want to see that guy, but it's only five o'clock. Huh. That's so pretty. Well... Let's go in here anyway. Whoop, I hit the wrong thing. Pack it up. How much is it to rent a room? Welcome to the inn below the tarnished teapot. I'll take a room. Are you sure? We have rats. You have rats. I'm sure. If you really want, first door on your left. Okay. Let's oh. find out. Well, this looks like a nice room. I can take a candle, I can read a book. Explorer's Guide to the Tiffmore Bluffs. The remote Tiffmore Bluffs are a well enjoyed destination for East Shadians. The bluffs were once filled with bustle following the industrious pow wind power boom. Today, that excitement has settled as travelers are now greeted by the gentle turning of windmills, fields of endless herbs, lure wild crafters to the area, and those knowing where to look may even view the remains of ancient ruins in the landscape. Anyone exploring the region should be sure to pack a coat or supply of mead to protect against the freezing winds swept up upon the bluffs at night. For extra enjoyment, bring sure to bring a tea kettle to take advantage of the many herbs growing in this wonderful land. Oh, wow. So that tells me I better get a jacket before I decide that I'm going to head to the bluffs. I want to just rest long enough that I can go and see the bard upstairs. Let's head up. time is it now? 6.57. Look! Oops. That was nice. Let's go ahead and go to bed for the night. Whoa! Okay. That was weird. In the morning, we will continue working and making some glowstones and getting ready to head elsewhere. I have a Patreon page. If you like my videos and want to help support my work, consider becoming one of my patrons on Patreon. 
Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video.